like I say, it's no secret. <clears throat> Every single time Lucifer Star or White Star took, had an expedition. Later on, they called these expeditions. Well, I wanted to know who exactly it was that did it because some expeditions were by French. Sometimes I did two expeditions at the same time where like the French or the Irish or the French or the, or the, or the, or the Mexicans were basically both going, taking a trip in my ships or, or, or on ships that they built. You know, I was paying them to go someplace like map out the Antarctica or map out Greenland or map out over here or go over there. <clears throat> or, or like I said, like, like, like the first things a lot of my ships did is they would go around the world at least one time just to prove their worth, to, to, to prove that they were a good enough ship because it takes about a year or so to get around the world, to sail around the world. So the first thing, first thing I had all my ships doing is my ships would, take one, would, would, would go on one circle of navigation of the world. So basically, they just spent six months or a year at sea, basically going around the world, testing out the new the, the new ship. And once it was tested out, they would do a couple other things for me, and then eventually I'd sell them after a couple of years. After about five or six or ten or fifteen years, I'd sell I'd sell them <clears throat> and and build another one. I'd sell them for what they're worth, you know, once they had been proven and everything else, and were basically tested out and everything and all the information would be calculated and all that other stuff and they would do some carrying hauls for me like carrying passengers or carrying supplies or doing this to do that to build something or something like that you know they would they would work for me for for a couple of years for two or three or four or five years and then I'd sell them or or 10 years you know depending like I said I I built a lot of ships I was always I was always the one with the newest ships so after about a year or two I'd sell them you know and then people would buy them and then they would use them that that's also why why when I was when when I, when I was um, when I was evacuating um, Europe basically I was I was like I was like all right I'm gonna have to call in some favors, and the thing is like I say everyone knew that I'd sold them their ships, like no one knew that knew how many ships I'd actually built and how many yards, and in one brief second for one minute I was like I need I need you guys to to, to go to go to, go to Europe and start picking up passengers, and so for about six months we basically evacuated. A third of of, of 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 Europe, basically. I called in all my favors. That's why that's how so many people got to America, because you know all the ships basically. You know, they were going to help out the creator or the builder of all the ships, so they started pulling people from so some from Europe. So like, <laughs> two thirds of Europe basically came to America. <laughs> So that's why all of a sudden <laughs> this continent basically went <laughs> ding, <laughs> and like Europe for a minute was evacuated, <laughs> and uh, and the black people and a lot of other people were like, what just happened? <laughs> like, oh, Lucifer Star just evacuated Europe. <laughs> we moved thousands or millions of people and supplies. Anyway, nobody could ever do a world evacuation like that except for me. After thousands of years or hundreds of thousands of years, basically I moved everyone over here to America. And we started building. And so in like half the time we built this place. Anyway, a lot of these things happened. This is, this is what happened in Europe. And this is why suddenly Europe basically became empty. <laughs> because like after hundreds of years of basically blah, 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 I basically moved everyone to America. All my people. So, like I say, um, basically a lot of pe a lot of black people were like, "What the fuck just happened? Everyone's gone." It's like, yeah, everyone's gone. I moved them all over here. So, and we were safe over here for the longest time. Anyway, whatever. You're gonna have to go back and look at and look at the facts yourself. Anyway, but there's a lot of expeditions, a lot of other stuff. And we were all just kicking it over here in America. And the Indians were like, okay. <laughs> yeah, because like, uh, like, 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 like I, I didn't know that because nobody ever came to America because America was basically forbidden. Um, and the Indians had kind of moved in and kind of multiplied like crazy because nobody ever came over here. So anyway, whatever. You know, I'm sorry, Indians. I love you guys. That's why later on I was like, all right, you guys, I, I'm, I'm going to be cool with you. I love you guys. And the Indians were like, hmm. Well, you know, technically they weren't supposed to be in America either, but they were. So anyway, though, whatever, though. But basically America suddenly got besieged by a bunch of people and we then they all started building. 
Hey, whatever. I'm just trying to kind of fill in some of the blanks of your existence so you kind of understand. And more than that, I don't know, ask the gypsies. Ask some of the other people. So that's why everyone's all confused about everything. It's like, well, this is kind of what happened. Hey, whatever.